hey everybody welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how to harvest uh, water spinach seeds they also go by morning glory or kang kong so these are um, water plants so they love the water and they also love the heat so these are best to be grown in the summer and uh, they will do really really well in hydroponic that's how i grew the plants that produce these seeds right here and uh, so when I picked the seeds, I wanted to test to see how well they would grow because the seeds were almost a year old. So this is the seeds right here. They, uh, they look like uh, uh, little chips, like chocolate chips. And so uh, that's the size of each of the seed. And then uh, let me, let's go outside. I, I'll show you what they look like inside the seed pot and, uh, and how to collect them. Okay, this is the remain of the water spinach that I grew last year uh, in hydroponic. And so uh, when I harvest the plants, I just took this whole thing out and I just left it in the sun for, uh, I think it's almost six months now. So anyway, it, it overwinter, it got wet, it got dry, it got rained on and everything. But anyway, here is what the, uh, the pods look like after the flowers are formed. The pods would look like this and then the pods would just eventually dry and it, it will remain on the plant and sometimes it will drop off and it will grow but uh, these are the ones that were left and so if you take the flowering pot and you you know pry it open you have these seeds right here see they're pretty good size for seeds and uh, they do produce a ton of seed and so these are more right here and so um they're very easy to grow you can just drop them in the ground and uh, when the water when the soil has good moisture and is warm they will sprout so let me show you a few that just that's dropped um, why when I was uh, moving these around and they grew so uh, let's take a look okay so here is uh, two plants right there so they they can grow pretty close to each other if you grow these uh, you know uh, harvest what you can save one plant and let them let them go to seed or if they get too old just let them go to seed and then you can just left the whole vine dried up to sit outside for probably up to a year or so and then you know and then you can get seeds out of them and grow them again so that's it um they're very easy and uh you can do this and uh, to save money on buying new seeds okay so the the kang kong or the ong choy the seeds uh, are like these they look um like little little peas i guess so i'll just put a bunch of them in there and i'll just mix them up and then i'm going to give it some water okay today we are on day number eight and look at the plants they are starting to show a good amount of leaves so today we are going to mix our nutrients and we're going to feed the plant so right now what we're going to do is lift this up and we're going to dump out this just the regular water and we're going to get fresh water for the the new uh, nutrients okay so uh, let's go ahead and dump this out Okay, so we'll put it like that. And what we're going to use is the Maxigrow series. And so here the instruction says to use one to two teaspoons per gallon of fresh water. And so what I'm gonna do is use one teaspoon per gallon. So this is a five gallon. So we're gonna use the five of the, five, the, the little teaspoons that they provide in here. So there it is right here. So we're gonna use five of this. Okay, so now we are going to spray water into it so that it would dissolve nicely. Okay, so let me go ahead and finish that up and I will show you. Okay, so I filled it up to uh, the very bottom of the uh, net cup right there. And so uh, the roots are touching the water level. And so that's what you need to do. And then we're going to leave this in the sun right here because these are uh, they love um, uh, warm temperature and then we'll just check back in maybe a week or so 
once they make progress okay today we are on day number 21 and the plants have grown really well it's gotten bigger here and uh, the cool thing about this is once I set it I basically forgot about it here's the uh, the root system the water level dropped a little bit and uh, we're just going to wait until uh, it gets taller and it'll be harvest time so uh, we'll be back soon okay welcome back today is day number 26 and today we are going to harvest some of these plants to use 